really good signature kit where like if she sits on the corner catches someone with a down sig suddenly you're gonna be in this edge guard situation that is very uncomfortable yeah it just is interesting to see the double blasters there because you know they've always been a bit of a double-edged sword in the doubles gameplay they're great for setting up kind of teeing up your teammates so that way they can come in and get consistent combos but you do get kind of locked in place for a while yeah, I mean, it's it's uh, kind of like Queen Eye, right? Like, it's great in, in twos when you have the teammate, but when you go down to the 1v2, like, you'll just get caught a lot of times. And there you're seeing Ooh. Ted and Knees catching everything right now as Simple and Heisen are struggling here in game number one. Yeah, and they went right back to just refreshing their double blasters. I mean, they did a phenomenal job with the leapfrog gameplay. Hey, I'll get that neutral light. You'll come over with the down air, and we'll just kind of keep going with setup after setup. And it scored two knockouts really early on. Tragic wire crossing there from Heisen and Simple, though, because Heisen charged up a side sig, and Simple was like, oh, I'm swapping weapons. Was I supposed to neutralize right now? Unfortunate. I mean, they managed to get the knockout onto Ted. They're setting up the edge guard onto knees. Whoa, big turnaround, but the coverage from Heisen to deny. Yeah, great pickup from Heisen, but Ted puts him down to his final stock. Knees catching Simple on the left side with a down light recovery. The ground pound comes out. Simple tries to fast fall away, but Heisen's the one to guarantee the KO. Man, it seems like every time Simple and Heisen try to fight their way back here, Ted and Knees just have another gear to shift to. Ted and Knees, they came out of this. Nobody really expected it. I mean, like, the percentages were definitely in favor of Heisen and Simple, but man, Ted and Knees looking so strong here in game number one. Four stocks left for the red team. Okay. Simple and Heisen definitely starting to button up their gameplay. A lot of ground coverage, a lot of landing on the de uh, denials on the landing. And that's why Ted and Knees have pretty much been thrown into the red, gotten knocked out, and Simple and Heisen barely got touched that stock. It ain't over till it's over. Stock count evened up, and the damage is not too bad. Nice interrupt there from Knees, making sure that the launch of that neutral light from Simple doesn't connect, and Simple has to avoid the edge guard. Still gets the wall touch. He's good. Oh, big side signature. Simple had to spend everything, those sweat beads coming out, just so he can get back on stage. Ball Head going out there. far. Pressure Ooh. onto Heisen. There's the tag. Meanwhile, Knees. In the 1v1, the Nair, and suddenly Ted, oh my the gosh. ground pound hits everyone, but blue team's the one to survive. It's left to knees in the 1v1 now as he does hit the side sig on simple. Sticking with the blasters. There's the oh. setup and phenomenal, unbelievable even. A little, a little unbelievable. If I hadn't seen it just now, I'm not sure I would have believed it, but Knees clutching it out there. Good movement, good recognition. You saw Heisen really trying to swing after getting caught there. Man, this was crazy. Yeah, Heisen this was just clearing the field, almost brought it back for his whole team. Knees just managed to squeak under and get back on stage. That second ground pound would have just completely given it to the blue team. Yeah, if that didn't launch Knees towards the stage, that would have been amazing for the blue team. Now we're going to be going into game number two. Ted and Knee's slight momentum advantage, but I, I think si Simple and Heisen were definitely adapting to them at the end of the game. Yeah, they were creeping back into that one, but really the question for me is like, what is the change up for Simple? Because he was under 300 damage in that last one. So he's gonna need to be uh, a little bit more aggressive in this one as he goes for the off stage and uh -oh. Ted goes for the uh -oh. turnaround. That's the recovery, but Simple gets up with the help of Ted's recovery. Yeah, I mean, he was like just about to touch the wall there. So may as well tack on the damage. But Simple, man, he has just been in dire straits this entire game. It's been 30 seconds where he just hasn't been on ground. He's been getting tagged left and right and just trying to get back in the fray. Oh, man, the Blasters play coming out. Again, double Blasters from this red team has been so effective. No KOs just yet, but both blue team members in the red. Man, so good at that leapfrog Ooh. style play. Yep, you're gonna tag my teammate, I'll make sure you pay for it, and you know, if we trade all the way down, well, we started this first, so we've got the extra stock to play with. Yeah, they were uh, keeping track of how many things were hitting things, and team combo comes out, simple with the target swap, doesn't ground pound onto knees though. And so that means knees still holds on, mm. but a nice side air, but they need to take down Ted here. 
Uh oh, dangerous. Right. Sweat beads, he needs help. Knees trying to go low, couldn't save him in time. And now the stock advantage in favor of the blue team off the back of a fantastic edge guard. And now they go for knees for the team combo, but Tyson not quite in position for the neutral light. He's definitely looking for a weapon drop here. Sneaks in, it's the blasters. Who comes in for the recovery. Who picks up Ted there, but no blue team member was ready for the follow-up. Big recovery, not yet enough. Tall ceiling here. Not tall enough to keep Simple alive though. Or Heisen off the second one. So many recoveries coming out onto the blue team, despite the fact that they had that uh, initial lead for a moment there. Red team really just uh, picked apart what the blue team was doing. All right, follow up. Simple goes in with a nair, but knees with a target swap. Man, knees has been doing such a great job on these target swaps. It's hit after hit. Just the rotation, a little bit of pressure relief for Ted. He's just making every right decision. Man, the dare drops. Oh, he gets away. Side sick thrown out. That's a punish, and that's a oh. follow up. But the recovery keeps Simple alive. What's the hit? Let's go. Bounced him off the stage. Last stock here. Knees in the 1v2. Some health to play with here, but Simple's got to play that back line. Man, Heisen really turning things around for the blue team. That double knockout, so clutch. Nice, the Nair, ground pound, side air, knees running out of jumps here, goes for the turnaround, right. taking someone with him, but that is a game for Heisen and Simple. I, I respect making sure that you get the knockout there, even if it's not going to secure you the game. Yeah, if I'm going down, I'm taking you with me. I'm going to grab your feet and bite your ankles. I mean, even if it's just, you know, to send a message, get in their head, and even just a little bit of practice in those clutch situations. Yeah, I mean... Take, take all the chances you get, but uh, well played to the blue team to keep this Look one close. That. Love that follow up there from Heisen on that end sig. Wasn't sure what he was gonna go for there. Man, so Simple and Heisen on the board. Very efficient knockouts for sure. Yeah, everybody staying under a thousand. Like you said, 900 is like that theoretical optimum but uh and simple and heisen pretty much hit that number on the head yeah right there's like a weapon toss too much they're like, all right we'll they, do one they less price weapon is toss. right today you know yeah. 900 and one simple gonna make the swap now over to the brin was not happy with his performance uh a second ago Simple just trying to find a way to land, but Ted not giving him any quarter. Oh, Simple is, he's kind of missing a little bit. A little bit of warm up time on the swap to the Brin. He has not been hitting too much here. All right, there's the Nair. Heisen was not ready for the follow up. Side sig connects. Ooh. Simple chasing deep there off that side sig, and the ground pound does not need to connect. Yeah, that was just a nice classic edge guard from Simple. Deny the options, starve them out, so that way they just can't make the distance. Ooh, but a great interrupt there from Ted. Simple had the downlight onto knees, but Ted came in from below, managed to make sure that he couldn't get that final hit. Big Sair, that's gonna launch knees down to his second stock. Ted comes in, hits the recovery, but the high ceiling of Demon Island. Yeah, Simple and Heisen really riding this momentum wave. They managed to turn it around in game number two, and now they've got a significant lead for game number three. Nice falling Sair. Here's the team combo into the Sair. Goes for the side light, still picks up more. Good didn't damage. Go for the big, uh, yeah, they didn't go for the big SIG, but still good damage. Yeah, that, that's the main thing. If you find yourself in like a little bit of an awkward situation, at least get that little bit of tag. All the damage will add up even if you're not able to confirm all the way for a knockout. Better than setting yourself up for punishment. Side sick thrown out, but simple with the punish. You know, nice wake up there from Knees. Yeah, I'm watching Knees. Ted now on final stock. Red team's got a little bit of their work cut out for him. 
But we've seen him do it before Ooh. as the team combo launches Heisen. Heisen manages to get back up, but Knees manages to take down Simple while Heisen was coming back. Oh, nice oh. recovery there. Yeah, Blaster's recovery from the right and from the left. Doesn't matter which way you dodge, you are going for a ride. Really just said good luck with that one. <laughs> Full send. It will even up the stock count. Knees and Ted here have uh -oh. a chance. Ted uh -oh. in danger. Yeah. Manages to get above that ground pound so that way he got knocked up, but you know, he took the damage for it. <laughs> Knees is dealing the damage for it. Simple getting into the red there. Down light goes for the side air nice. there. Ted over on the gauntlets. There are some incredibly hard hitting Ooh. signatures. Doesn't even need it. That side air might spell doom for Simple. He's out of here. Heisen left alone. 1v2, he does have the most health here, but he's got to avoid getting caught, and he is very much getting caught right now. There's been a little bit of uh, some flubs on confirms, a little bit of friendly fire, but they're still building that damage onto Heisen, and there it is, down air into side air. Classic blasters to seal the deal, go up 2-1 in the set. Now Ted and Knees are on set point, despite all the predictions about to knock down Heisen and Simple into the elimination side of the bracket. This would be huge. What's the what's the power rank difference on this one? Uh, does it say it over here? I can figure I it out. I am curious. I can figure it out. Oh, well, we got it on screen right now. 11 and 20 for Ted and Knees against five and 10 for Heisen and Simple. That is a significant difference. Uh, although I guess like if you really looked at it like 10 and 11, okay, that's kind of close. But look at Ted coming in PR number 20, Ooh. but he's still doing his work. Put out 610 damage, the most in that last game. Yeah, tons of damage, tons of confirms. He's gotten those knockouts, those big signatures. And I gotta tell you, he just meshes so well with knees. The coverage that they had to deny any kind of dodge on those double blasters recoveries, unreal. Now we're starting to see a little bit more bow play come out from Knees. It's definitely been a lot about that double blasters from this team. Now we're seeing him try to play some bow, but Heisen comes in with a falling side air on the back of Ted. Another falling side air from Heisen. Charges up the down sig. Not going to connect, but the end sig from Simple. Yeah, really just keeping Knees on his heels and scoring the knockout. Setting up the edge guard, Ted, can he make it back? Still needs to find his way around that corner. Simple denying and scoring the knockout. Nice change up from Simple there. I think in the earlier games, he was throwing out a lot of those side sigs over the corner. Mm. And now he's like, you know what? I'll play a little bit safer, kind of the classic simple edge guard of staying on stage and then coming in with the side air. Yeah, that was just really smart, so clean. Good fastfall, good movement from Simple around Ted. Right side though, knees starting to get Ooh. that damage built up on the Heisen. Ted looking to take out Simple here, just misses the dive kick, gonna reset everything for Simple. Oh, the hit from Heisen at the top of the map. That means Ted's down to his final stock while both blue team members are on there first. Heisen tries to interrupt, but Knees doesn't get the double. Yikes, all right, so Ted is going to have to play this game absolutely flawlessly. I, I imagine we're gonna see him play a bit more of that support role, just because that's usually what we see when somebody goes on their last stock very early on. Yeah, and I mean, we talked about it earlier, right? Blaster's a great tool as that support player. You can kind of sit further back, utilize that range. Ted doesn't seem to care. I mean, he is just going off stage <laughs> and swinging for it. He's like, I could support, or I could just, I could KO one of them, and then we'll, we're basically back even. He's looking to, you know, he's like, I'll, I'll carry my own weight. Those stocks that got taken from me, I'll take it back and double it. That's me and Valorant saying, I got mine. <laughs> even if I didn't, I got mine. Side air from Ted, trying to take down Simple. Top of the map, knees with the recovery. Simple's gonna go down. Still a chance here for this red team, but Heisen's so healthy. Oh man, almost got the hit, but Ted is out of here. Knees left alone against three stocks. Just chase got the dodge. hit for the chase dodge. He's gonna have to stick and move, stay mobile. There's nice one, two to go. Yo, Simple just catches him with the neutral light. Damage trades are not in favor of knees and this is where we're talking Yikes. about blasters in the 1v2 it just locks you down heisen comes in hits that end sig down light side air knees is done for game number four we're going to game five yeah simple sword edge guards are just so clean 
just very textbook plays because he wrote the textbook. Yeah, I mean, he's he's got just kind of that very classical sword edge guard style of like, I'm just gonna sit here. You still have to use all your movement to come back up, and I'll just downlight side air. Eventually, it's just gonna work out. Absolutely beautiful. So we are bringing this all the way to a game five full distance. Tough calls all around as Ted and Knees make the swap here, bringing out oh. the Rick for Yo. game number five. Still keeping the double blasters, but he's like, you know what? Game Admittedly five. not doing too much with my gauntlets. Put out about 19 Three, damage with my two, gauntlets. Maybe one. I'll just throw out the ax and do one attack and basically do that much damage. Okay, that's fair. Also, I, I think there might be a little bit of a decision here for the stats. You know, that Rick, he's got a ton of defense. Going to keep him in play for that much longer, especially because Ted was kind of the one to fall very, very early on. Yeah, also a, a big call there with that high defense. As Heisen uh -oh, might not matter. Comes in, swings, sends Ted to the outside, but he still survives that defense coming into okay, play. Okay, yeah, he would have been blasted out by those last two hits for sure on any other legend. But you can only afford so many hits. Ground pound attempted. Knees gets back up safely. I didn't even call out the fact that Knees is the one who took the cross. Is no longer on the Diana. Man, you see Simple starting to just really bunny hop around. Just all this dipping movement. Jump fastball, jump fastball. But Knees catches both blue team members. Gets him with the downlight Cider. Cider's his teammate there. Nice there from Heisen. Maintaining this lead as Ted might go down to his final stock early again. Oh no, Ted, even with the swap for the high defense. First one onto his last stock, a minute and a half Ooh. in. But Nay, uh, Nee is really putting in the work that he can. He got a downlight recovery onto Heisen and then chase Simple for that ground pound. Interruption stops the team combo. But man, Ted is taking hit after hit here. Oh, and he gets the caught quick in the handle. middle of All it. right, Knees with the interrupt. Manages to save him, but Ted really can't take any more hits. Yeah, he's got to play the ultimate support role right now. Dangerous. He's just swinging over that corner. Unfortunately, Knees taking a ton of damage. In the meantime, oh. spiked. And it's all left to Knees. He might have two stocks left to his name, but so do both blue team members. Four stocks left, very healthy, and they get their pick of weapon denial. Knees now, he's got to run the gauntlet. Yeah, a little bit of leapfrog damage. Again, just everything adding up. And, you know, they, they can do that. They can go ahead and say, I'll hit you and my teammate. It doesn't really matter. We have enough stocks to play with. I mean, like, even if you didn't have that, like, damage fall off on hitting your teammate, like, they still are coming in with more defense. As Knees Ooh. with a great edge guard there. Side air into the ground pound. And Heisen just, like, watched it. He was like, uh, we'll try again. Come well, back up here. <laughs> I, I understand. You know, you don't want to take any serious risks just because you can set up another double edge guard as soon as Simple respawns. Very fair, and there it is. Heisen, Nair, Sare, closing it out. Game five, three, two victory for Heisen Simple. Wow, I, I honestly did not expect that one to go to game number five. I, I know chat definitely didn't. Yeah, right? Those predictions were like, yeah, Simple and Heisen are gonna win this. You were right, but man, it was so close to not being so. Yeah, I mean, Knees and Ted looked so strong early on, but then again, like Heisen and Simple,